getting some opening credits here. Are we going to the Bat Cave? It's me. I should just go into my house and say it's me and shit would turn on. Episode one. Realm of Shadows. Another brutal week in Gotham, folks. A string of home invasions rippled through the city's already crime-infested East I'm End. Apparently, the bandits are using stolen GCPD battery rams to Oh, he kept them. Oh, put him back in that thing. Tonight. And we have breaking news tonight. Five criminals are in custody this evening after a break in at City Hall. But thanks to the efforts of the Batman, the stolen items were returned. Not all of them. Let's <laughs> see what she was really after. Allegations that Dent may have actually been involved in the break in. Talk about dirty politics. Does Hill's oh. campaign really think these accusations hold any water with the voters? The back computer should be able to read whatever data is on that stolen drive. Yes. And in other news, where's the drive at? Three of the factory fire that will not end. Crews have given up trying to combat oh, okay, the blaze at the Otisburg Processing Center, owned by Ace Chemical. Nearly fell off a building for this. Check the codec. Happen to breathe in any of that tar black smoke. Oh, look at that. And one mobster's murder caused quite a headache for commuters this morning. The body of Falcone family capo Louis Pistachio Garmoni was found hanging off the side of the 4th Street Bridge sometime just before okay. dawn, causing traffic to back up for miles as the cops cut him down. Right, let's check whatever this is. Random stabbings are the latest headache for the riders of Gotham's overcrowded Skyrail cars to contend with. Gotham police are investigating multiple cases of riders all right, receiving all right. wounds from Gordon. an ice pick or other pointed weapon while pressed Arkham into Asylum the replacement. With fellow passengers. Good to know. A few have died, what else we got? Most have been admitted to Gotham General in critical condition. The police don't have any suspects at the time. Two more okay. patients have gone missing from Arkham Asylum, That's... bringing the total number of escapees from the half prison, half mental hospital to 15 this year. That's depressing. The Bat Gaming Chair. We're gonna play some Quake. Let's find out what was so important. Of course it is. Wayne Manor has seven bedrooms, two kitchens, a library, a gymnasium, a basketball court, and a movie theater. And yet I always find you here. <laughs> in a dark, damp cave. I like in front of a computer. I'm more at home here than the rest of the house, you know that. Then we should build an eighth bedroom down here. <laughs> sure, I can see the headlines now. Bruce Wayne, billionaire, entrepreneur, cave Quite an eclectic resume. Did you find out what that um, cat woman tried to steal? Well, in the process. What are we looking at? Let me try a different angle. Yeah, let's encrypt it quicker. Okay, let's look around here. What do we got? Feeling it like this is the thing. No? Can I zoom out? No. Can't zoom in either, so. I'm not seeing anything like. This is a map of the east side shoreline. 
There we go. But it could mean any number of things. Money, weapons, drugs, everything flows through that port. Maybe it's where Mayor Hill picks up his dry cleaning. Hmm. Can't make sense of it yet. There's still plenty of files to decrypt. It's at zero percent. I guess where was it what one? I could. Thanks, Al. Yeah, the same couldn't be said for the bar. I had to literally pry Mrs. Zeller back away. But ah. you're pleased to hear everyone has left, including Mr. Falcone. Before the game switched from billiards to cutthroat. I'd recommend leaving the fist fights to your alter ego. Bloodstains are much harder to remove from a tuxedo. Yeah, thanks for the interruption. <laughs> well, it wasn't for you, Bruce. I was worried I might drink all my good scotch. <laughs> for the record, your father despised men like Falcone, thought they ruined Gotham's stellar reputation. Back when it still had one? It can again, Bruce. Though people like this Catwoman aren't helping. Meow. Is she new to town? I've never seen her before. Hopefully, she's just a tourist. No, I already checked the codex. Not much to find, apparently. A few burglaries, break-ins. Seems to lay pretty low. You could learn a thing or two from her. Hmm. You can't step outside without it ending up in the news lately. As Bruce or Batman. I don't like being compared to a common criminal. No, I think you're missing the point. You have to admit you've been drawing a lot of attention to yourself, and not the playboy billionaire buys new yacht kind of attention. <laughs> I don't mean to beat a dead argument, but... No one's gonna figure it out now, trust me. Miss Vale noticed your injuries, so did Mr. Dent. If they put it together with the incident at the mayor's office, it would undo all the long nights and close calls we've endured to get here. Mm -hmm. You're in the spotlight more than ever. You have to be careful. You're right, you're right. I should have cancelled the event. But I know how much pressure you're under. I don't mean to add to it. It's okay. I, I know you're only looking out for me. If we make a suit that fits me, we can trade places some night. <laughs> but I'm not partial to heights. <sighs> Old men worry, that's all. It's our gift and our curse. One more worry for the list. I thought I saw Oz. It's been, what, 20 years? Last time I saw him, we were in grade school. Indeed. You two were thick as thieves. Oswald, however, took that role more literally than you. <laughs> Dishonorable discharge, illegal boxing matches, arms dealing, prison stents? That's a criminal grand slam, if I'm using the expression correctly. Unfortunately, you are. Oswald claimed he only wanted to catch up, but his behavior following his family's collapse is troubling. Hmm. Why he's returning now, I haven't the faintest idea. Do you think he might know something about the break-in? This Catwoman shows up around the same time Oswald comes back to town. Might not be a coincidence. Oswald's hmm. crimes, numerous they may be, are on a much smaller scale than robbing City Hall. Well, he was always trouble growing up, but... Old's greatest it's detective. Fun kind of trouble. You both were. Even though you and young Master Cobblepot used to be close. Cobblepot? Cautious. But I know you can't abandon a good mystery until it's solved. I'll be careful, Alfred. When you see what's become of his park, I think you will. Oh no! Cobblepot Park. Oh, this is an interesting telling of this story. Hmm. Where are you, Oz? Let's look at that. No, hey, no, that's not what I'm trying to do! Ah! Uh, just gonna look at the 
thing. I want to go back. I want to go back. Fuck you. I'm not done yet. Let me look at the thing. Thank you. Well, that guy's dying. Let's see if he's okay. Oh. Wow, this park has seen better days. Homeless person. Kick him! <coughs> Give him some change. Uh, no thank you, sir. Still some to eat. Burning barrel. I see some dudes with mohawks out there. That you know what that means. It's gonna be some trouble. Oh, don't pull your phone out now. Burning late. <sighs> Great. There's the statue, but. No odds. Does this run away? There's gonna be a there's gonna be a Mohawk guy out here somewhere. There's a Mohawk guy right there. Smoking man. Shopping cart. What up, smoking man? Hey. Beat it. Damn, he is ugly. Beat it. Well, fuck you. You know what? I would I was just saying hi. Asshole. Let's try to make a friend. Beat it. You beat it. This is the eighties. Well, it isn't what it used to be. I would like to read that, but thanks, game. Let's check out the statue. Watch Wallet Cash. But this fucking goes knew through it. you. You heard him, man. You're making a mistake. You already made one coming here. The next one kills you. And him. Gentlemen. Oz. Keep walking, all right? This don't concern you, twerp. You see, that's where you're mistaken. My old mate and I have some catching up to do. Listen to that <laughs> fucking <laughs> accent. I love it. Come here. Think that'll do. I hit the wrong button. Stay down. Oh, Jesus. Oh, gosh. Yes. This got bad. This used to be a nice place. No lives like you don't belong. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Yep. Good night. This is my park! Mine! You hear that? <laughs> Oswald, you, you're oh. in. Hey, Bruce. You've got a little, uh... Hey. Good as new. Woo! That was the right little scrap, eh? Nothing kickstarts the system like a dash of adrenaline, eh? Besides, someone needed to deal with the rubber situation here. Well, thanks for the backup. I yanked you away from your bloody ivory tower, Bruce. Least I can do is make sure you don't get shanked. <laughs> oh, that's very thoughtful of you. Yeah, it's been what? Two like a decades. And you know what? I haven't been mugged once that entire time. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, that wasn't why I brought you here, mate. Right now, I am trying to recognize the little Bruce. I used to run around this place with back when it wasn't, you know, like this. This park used to mean something. A place that was safe for kids, for families. 
People came from all over to visit. Well, those were better days. That they were. Yeah. Thought we'd grow up to be kings, I did. Well, one of us. Both of us. <sighs> this city chews right through people. <sighs> Mum committed to Arkham. Dad. Ended it yourself, he did. Hmm. My family's fortune. There's nothing left, Bruce. I know. Alfred told me. <sighs> it's funny, huh? Same place that ground my family to dust. Gave you the good life. Aww. Used to run in the same circles we did. Hobnobbing parties, round-the-world vacations, unlimited potential. My parents are gone too, Oz. I know, Bruce, I know. I'm sorry for it. But I have my own funerals to attend. Good to know you haven't changed, Bruce. You still care about something more than just yourself. Hmm. Although, I was surprised to see Carmine Balcone at your party last night. Made himself right at home, that oily... <sighs> Falcone was an uninvited guest. That's it. Never want to see his face again. On that, we can agree in earnest. <laughs> Falcone made a stack of cash and corpses a mile high, ruining families like mine. All he needs is a little push. And... It'd be a treat to watch him at pavement. Sorry, mate. This reunion got a lot more grim than I planned. <laughs> Things are gonna be on the upswing soon, though. I got a plan, mate. A revolution is knocking on Gotham's door. And I'm here to let it in. Which brings me to you, Bruce. You see, you throw a rock in any direction, you break a window that Wayne Enterprises owns. As the rich and powerful go, oh, you top Gotham's list. Hmm. But when my revolution starts, we're gonna smash windows and cross off names all the way down. Like I said, it's not gonna be pretty. It's gonna be beautiful. I'm not your enemy, Oz. That remains to be seen, don't it? I've got great affection for you, Bruce. I really huh. do. Which is why I'm warning you. When this whole thing starts, make sure you're on the right side. What? Good seeing you, Bruce, but I got some rocks to collect. Cheers. I don't like this. Why can't we just be friends, buddy? I guess I just can't have friends. Look at that. That is beautiful. Mr. Wayne, over here, right here. This way. Bruce, Bruce. Morning, everyone. Morning, Mr. Dent. Hey, Bruce, you mind if we swap cars? I mean, mine isn't fast and the paint's rusting off, but. Boy, does she have charm. <laughs> well, we didn't bring you all out here to discuss cars, honestly. <sighs> now, we're here about Arkham Asylum. Ever since it opened its doors, Arkham has been a breeding ground for the criminally the insane. Oh, no. Its methods for rehabilitation, crude. Its security, lacking. And worse <laughs> still, those who do get out, or God forbid escape, are even more dangerous than before they went in. Call Arkham oh, Asylum shit. is a cancer on Gotham. <clears throat> but today, with a sizable contribution from this man here, yeah. we break ground on a state-of-the-art mental health care facility. One that will improve the well-being of Gotham and its citizens for years to come. Now, Mr. Wayne has a few words he'd like to say. 
I do? Bruce? My parents loved Gotham. They invested their blood, sweat, and tears in this city. <sighs> their lives, too. You know, when I was uh, nine years old, my parents took me to see a movie about a hero in a mask. It was a hero who stood up to oppression and defended the people from injustice, no matter the cost. That night, my parents paid the ultimate cost defending me from a man <clears throat> who needed the kind of help this new facility will provide. Cuckoo. My parents were heroes that night, and we can all learn from their sacrifice. Yeah! Today, on the anniversary of that fateful night, we, made we that dedicate this facility to Thomas and Martha Wayne, and usher in a new era of healing for Gotham. I guess I didn't do too well. I'm, uh... Sure, you all have plenty of questions about the new hospital, so let's open it up. You first, Miss Vale. Thank you. With the opening of this new hospital, what does this mean for Arkham Asylum? What happens to the old building? I think Arkham has only done harm to Gotham. It's made criminals more unstable, put our citizens in jeopardy. They will remember that. We can do better. All right, who's up next? Uh, you there. Mr. Wayne, Julia Remark of the Tribune. Okay. My sources say you welcomed alleged mob boss Carmine Falcone into your home. You and Mr. Dent even spoke with him behind closed doors. I don't make friends with gangsters. He was an unwelcome guest. Yeah! That's all. Fuck next that Next question, guy. please. Please, keep your questions on topic, people. We're here about the hospital, remember? I'm gonna ignore it for now. Uh, but Mr. Wayne, this morning the Globe received evidence of an offshore bank account managed by Carmine Falcone and your father, Thomas Wayne. What exactly are you implying? What? Transactions connected to organized crime going back years and continuing to this day. The paper trail ties your family directly to the mob. Why is the music being weird? Care to comment? And did anyone else receive this evidence? The Globe, the Gazette, we all did. Mr. Wayne, oh, Mr. Mr. Wayne, is all your money dirty? Is the Wayne family legacy built on lies? Oh, this went did bad. You know about this, Bruce? How long has your family been dealing with Falcone? Could the allegations be true? What aren't you telling us? Does the mob sign Wayne Enterprises' paychecks? My parents were entrepreneurs, philanthropists, not common criminals. It's absurd. Mr. Wayne, Mr. Wayne! How long has your family been dealing with Falcone? Could the allegations be true? Oh, this went bad. Did you know about this, Bruce? What aren't you telling us? I'm sorry about this, Bruce. I don't know where the hell it's coming from. Damage controls my territory. We'll talk later. Everyone, everyone, please settle down. I'll be fielding your questions from here on out. Pick your phone please, up. Let's try to keep this civilized. I kind of regret not doing it now. Bruce, I've been trying to reach you. The police are inside the manor. They might find out I'm Batman. Hey, hey, careful! Put it back. I'm afraid we can't, Mr. Wayne. Says who? This warrant. Oh, you can come in and do what you want. It's not personal. I had the boys turn the lights off, keep a low profile. I understand. You're just doing your job, Lieutenant. Trying to? It's hard to be a cop in this city. Every battle's uphill, in the rain, with skates on. <laughs> Alfred, keep an eye on them. Make sure they only take what they have to. Of course, sir. I meant what I said about not personal. We only want files related to Wayne Enterprises. The warrant covers your place, pardon me, places of residence, and any companies you own. Your holdings are extensive. Who authorized this? I know you and the DA are buddy buddy, but this one came from the top. Oh shit. It's a valid warrant. I gotta serve it. Mayor Hill signed off on this himself. 
As long as he's mayor, he calls the shots. Well, Hill has a history of making his opposition disappear. <laughs> Rumors and allegations, Mr. Wayne, that's all. But if they become fact, I'll handcuff him myself, same as any other crook. I don't know how your neck ended up on Mayor Hill's shopping block, but here we are. Hill knows if I go down, Harvey's campaign goes down too. That'd be a real shame. Mr. Dent's the only DA I ever trusted to make a conviction stick. As <laughs> mayor, I think he can finally turn things around for us. Yeah? For all our sakes, I pray you've got nothing to hide. You're a... what a dickhead thing to do! Right in front of the lieutenant and everything. Aww. You got like thousands of those photos anyway. Bruce! Stay back! Are we gonna get that? Yep. Take whatever you Here we want. go! You don't have to do this. Oh, this is actually a really good version. At least I didn't go all the way back and like do a live. Oh man. Well done. Bruce. Bruce. We dead now. Oh. I made myself sad. 